in the earlier classes, we have learned about lines, rays, line segments, angles and triangles. In this chapter, we will learn about the properties of triangles in detail. Triangle. We mark three non-collinear points A, B and C on a sheet of paper and draw all possible segments. The possible segments AB, BC and CA. A simple closed curve formed by these three segments, no two of which are in one straight line, is called a triangle. We can name it in one of the following ways. Triangle ABC, Triangle BCA, Triangle CAB, Triangle CBA, Triangle ACB, Triangle BAC. The segment AB, BC and CA are called the sides of the triangle ACB. The points A, B and C are called the vertices of triangle ACB. Vertices is the plural of vertex. The side AB, BC, CA are written as CAB respectively. In this chapter, we will learn about triangles, angle properties and Pythagoras theorem. Triangle We mark three non-collinear points. A, B and C on a sheet of paper and draw all possible segments. The segments are AB, BC and CA. A simple closed figure formed by these three segments, no two segments of which are in a straight line, is called a triangle. We can name it in one of the following ways. Triangle ABC, Triangle BCA, Triangle CAB, Triangle CBA, Triangle ACB, or Triangle BAC. The segments AB, BC, and CA are called the sides of the triangle ABC. The points A, B and C are called vertices, plural of vertex, of the triangle ABC. These sides AB, BC, CA are written as CAB respectively. We can classify triangles according to the sides and angles. Classification according to sides. Equilateral triangle, a triangle that has sides of the same length. Isosceles triangle, triangle that has two sides of the same length. Scalene triangle, a triangle that has sides of different lengths. Classification according to angles. Acute triangle, a triangle that has angles smaller than 90 degree. Right triangle, a triangle that has one angle equal to 90 degrees. Obtuse triangle, a triangle that has one angle greater than 90 degrees. Perimeter of a triangle. The sum of the lengths of the sides of a triangle is known as its perimeter. Let the lengths of the sides of a triangle be A, B and C, then its perimeter, denoted by 2S, is equal to A plus B plus C. Here S is the semi-perimeter of the triangle. Medians of a triangle A median of a triangle is a line segment joining a vertex to the midpoint of the side opposite to that vertex. Here, in triangle DEF, G is the midpoint of EF, so DG is a median. Altitude of a triangle An altitude of a triangle is the perpendicular drawn from a vertex to the opposite side, produced if necessary. Here, in triangle PQR, PM is perpendicular to QR. So, PM is the altitude from P on QR. It is also known as the height of the triangle. Note, a triangle has three altitudes, a triangle has three medians.